Hello and welcome back to Factorio. We're playing with a randomized recipes mod. Having fun with it so far. It's a little strange. It's sort of like, um, you gotta kind of learn the game all over again. Not completely, but everything you know about the recipes, just forget about it. They're all different. So, uh, it's a bit odd. Now, I brought a, I built a, a wall here. I went down about halfway. I need to bring it uh, a bit further down to the shoreline here. Um, I wanted to have it this far out so that I had the coal and the iron inside. So I can make the armor piercing ammo. I can't do it with just the iron, so uh, we're going to have to do this. And there's a big biter nest down there I'm going to have to take care of. So let's do that. Now we've been having constant attacks up here. Uh, and um, the turrets have been holding them off pretty well. I added a few more. And a few attacks up here. I should probably add more turrets. No attacks on the west side yet. I don't think pollution is reaching that far. But uh, let's see if we can... Build this wall. Still doing it manually, don't have... Uh, don't have bots yet. But that's okay. I only have to do it once, really. And then if I want to expand out a bit more, by the time that happens, I'll have bots. So, no big deal. Shouldn't take more than a few minutes to get this done. Now, the biter nest down there, that... That's a big one. Oh, God. Here they come. Okay, it was not expecting... that. Alright, I gotta take care of the nest. I've got armor piercing ammo on me. Uh, the grenades will be helpful. Oh, they've got they've got medium worms now. Oh. Hope I have enough ammo for all this. I think I do. Ow, ow, ow. One alien worm down. Or medium worm. Oh, 
Yeah, armor piercing ammo is really a necessity for these things. Uh -huh. Not so important early on, but at this point, it is uh, coming in handy. Okay, uh, that that was tough. Okay. How far do we have to go? Uh, quite a ways. Uh, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have... Let's see, I'm gonna be building the armor-piercing ammo. Right here. I can just feed it over here. Have it go down here and then uh, up there. So, for now, just so I don't have to feed these manually. Let's just uh, dump some ammo in there. Now I'm using uh, the regular ammo to start with. Uh, I can't I can't dump too much. I'm gonna need some of it for biter bases. Well, no, there's no more biter bases in the way. Let's just yeah, dump all of it in there. Um, I've got some. Armor piercing rounds on my inventory. We'll use those for turrets to put down if, um, or to feed into turrets that I put down if I need to blow up any any more biter bases, which I might if they made any any more. It is possible they have expanded in here, and I missed it, so I'm gonna have to watch out for that. Okay, I've just been researching uh, combat upgrades, mostly. And I'll continue with that. How much? How many grenades do I have? 76? That's fine. No more big biter bases, so it, that should be enough. Now we can do flammables. Um, don't know what that's gonna take. That might still take oil. Let's just uh, try it. It would. Uh, it'd be great if. Um, I can make flammable liquid out of water or something, but uh, I don't think I'll get that lucky. All right, we're getting close. I might have enough materials. Uh, 
Uh, not enough walls. Oh, I'm building... I'm building the, uh, <laughs> the conveyor belt the wrong way. Whoops. I forgot. I changed it. Changed direction. Okay, how close are we? Uh, almost there. I do need a bunch more walls. Let's go ahead and get uh, go back and get some walls and uh, more ammo. And uh, we just finished research on flammables. I'll have a look at that in a moment. Certain non-renewable resources like uh, wood. Uh, wood and something else. I can't remember. Um, any item that requires uh, wood as a as part of its recipe isn't randomized. And uh, we won't see wood used in any recipes that are randomized, so you're not going to have a problem, an issue where uh, you have to use a non-renewable resource to mass-produce something, thankfully. It's uh, smart about that. Okay, 300 walls. That might be enough. Flammables. That doesn't uh, give me any new recipes. Does that uh, just allow me to make... Oh, that just allows me to make the flamethrowers. Okay. And then I think I use... Uh, oil. Yeah, as a fuel. Okay. Uh, to do the flamethrower turret, I need plastic. Can't make that yet. Uh, stronger explosives. Do that. Let's just uh, keep... Keep researching uh, combat. Combat stuff. Okay, let me grab more belts there. And do I need anything else? Uh, let's just grab some plates for the hell of it. Always like to have a few on me. Here we are. So we'll get this done. And then, um... And then we'll start, uh, producing the... Armor-piercing ammo to feed these. Alright, I finished the wall. I've got turrets going down all the way to the shore here. That is a long wall. Okay, so the only opening is on the southwest side. 
We're still going to have biters coming in from there. So we'll deal with that uh, next. But first, let's go ahead and get a armor piercing round uh, production set up here. Should be pretty easy. I can just copy and paste from the other one. Let's go up here. Uh, that's what I want, yeah. Yeah, once we get all of these uh, walls set up, then I can just concentrate on uh, science and production of everything we need to uh, launch a rocket. Right now, I'm not really making any progress on that. Okay, the ore comes in there. Okay, uh, science. We just finished a uh, flamethrower. I don't know how useful these are going to be in this playthrough. I assume they just take the same fuel as the base game. Yeah, oil, light oil and heavy oil. Okay. Let's, um, let's research trains and fluid wagons. I'm not really going to use those right now, but I might need them. So better to be ready. Okay, let's get a few miners here. Need more power poles. Now I'm gonna need to smelt uh, some of this iron, not a whole lot. Okay, I can do that right, uh, right here, that's fine. Okay, we got the iron smelting set up. It's all connected. Now I just need uh, a little bit of coal. Not very much. And uh, I gotta put some turrets around this in case they attack from the west. I don't think they will, but... It's possible they could expand... From the west uh, closer to here. Before I've walled off that area. So, I don't want all of this getting destroyed. That would be bad. Oh, I think I'm going to run out of conveyor belts here. Okay, now I got to connect all this up to uh, the network.
I can grab power from uh, by the turrets over here. There we go. And there's the ore coming in. I'm going to need a lot more than that, though. Uh, let's get some more. Make some more belts. I'm going to need more, I think. No, I think I'm good. Maybe I'm good. Okay, that's going to put the ammo on the correct side of the belt. I think it is. Yeah, the top side here. Yeah, that's that's right. Okay. power up those coal miners. There we go. Okay, and uh, let's put down a radar. That'll be good. I'll put it down down here. And I don't need a lot of ammo, just enough to withstand one attack. If I see this area getting attacked, I'm going to have to uh, respawn right away and take out any nearby biter nests. Alright, let's repair that. Okay, that should be all I need. Now, we should be getting... Yeah. Yeah, we're getting all the ingredients. We just need more uh, ore. None of it's getting to these sticks. Okay, slowly but surely, that should work. How many miners do I have up here? Oh, quite a few. 32. Uh, it stopped. Oh, it, it's backed up. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need to open that up. I want more of a stockpile. Powers, okay.
Yeah, still mostly being eaten up by the ammo there. So we can use a few. A few more. Ah, uh, that's it. No more belts. Okay, I think that'll be fine. Yeah, with everything running, I think my power is gonna... cap out. Uh, I think that's a full belt there. Gonna have to upgrade it with uh, red later. Red belts. There we go. Starting to see some ammo move down the line there. Yeah, they're all running, so it's running full speed. Okay, I think that'll be enough to supply this whole wall. Nice. Okay, I'm real curious about these concussion turrets. I made a few. 65% more bullet per, per bullet. Uh, they have a higher range, too. Damage bonus 40% times 2? Uh, that's odd. I think that's the uh, damage bonus from the research. But it doesn't show it for the regular gun turrets? That is kind of odd. Okay, these concussion turrets, I'm going to put them... Uh, in areas where I'm being attacked a lot. It might be a, a good idea. Alright, we can choose another research, though. Um, let's see. Bullet damage. It's expensive. Uh, I should probably get plastics. We're gonna be needing that soon. Okay, that's petroleum glass, a gas, and iron sticks. Let's go ahead and get that. And uh, automated rails. Cue that up. Okay, I think I'm mostly good here. I want to put down a bunch of radars across the wall, but I'll do that later because my power... Uh, I don't know if my power can handle that many radars. Let's get some more steam engines and boilers. Alright, let's get out of here. I think this uh, area is safe and secure. Let's go west a little bit. Make sure there's no biter nests spawning. I don't see any. I think I'm good. Ah, uh, there's one right there. I'm going to leave it there. Yeah, they should be... I think when the pollution triggers them, they're not going to go after my ammo production here, I hope. I think they'll... We'll go north. Well, we'll see what happens. I, I think my ammo production there is uh, fairly well defended. Should be able to hold off an attack or two. Uh, okay, what was I going to do? Right. 
Uh, let's go north. I'm, I'm being attacked a lot up north. Let's try some of these concussive turrets. Yeah, here would be a good spot for him. Grab some more ammo. Yeah, nice range on those things. Put two there. They're quite expensive, and I can't really automate them right now. Um, but eventually I will. Alright, let's put one here, one there. I'll save the other one for later. Oh, they take a lot of pistols. That's the main thing, I think. The pistols. Uh, the constant combinators. Yeah, those aren't too bad. Maybe I could automate them. The main thing is all the pistols, uh, but those are those. I think those are easy to make. They just uh, take a lot of materials because we need fourteen of them. Yeah, they just take iron and stone. Uh, let's um. Fill some of this in here. Okay, the green wire, that's electronic circuit, stick, stone furnace is just stone. Pistol is iron plate and stone. Okay, that's going to take red wire and green wire. Okay, yeah, we can do this real quick. So... You can do it right here. Stone and iron plate. And that takes uh, how long to craft? Five seconds. I gotta get more everything. More belts, more everything. Let's see. I keep having to refer back to these because I, I can never remember the ingredients. I'm just trying to 
figure out the best way to order this based on my needs. It's like my first day of playing Factorio all over again. So I'm going to need stone for the furnaces and the pistol. And I also need iron plate for the pistol. And the undergrounds take uh, pistols as well. Okay, do I need iron plates for anything except the pistol? I uh, guess, for the circuits. Okay, uh, one of these can make stone furnaces, the other two pistols. Okay, I'm gonna need copper over here. We're out of undergrounds again. undergrounds copper and pistols oh boy okay i should automate that for sure let's just uh get some more pistols here i can borrow some of these to make uh, undergrounds. Okay, how many wires am I going to need for all this? Uh, quite a few. iron gear wheels I'm gonna need to bring bring the uh, ore down here Smart thing to do would be use a calculator for all this. Uh, this is going to be... I have no clue. There's going to be some bottleneck for, uh, somewhere and it's going to be uh, running at a snail's pace. Okay, so 
No, I don't need that there. What did I need the gear wheels for? Oh, I needed that for the... Constant Combinator. That's uh, red wire and gear wheels, right? Oh, right. Okay, let's move that down. I'm going to get this finished today. This one is gear wheels. Okay, yeah, we'll get the uh, iron sticks and green circuits on this belt here. Okay. Now I just need uh, the ore or the sticks. I think I've got everything. Can I borrow it from over here? That'd make things a bit easier. All right, that's gonna be very ugly. But that should work. Let's uh, power it up. Unless I'm missing something. Yeah, it's all getting done. Hey, it works. Yeah, as long as it gets done, that's fine. Oh man, we need 19 constant combinators. getting done. Anyway, I can always use the regular turrets uh, in the meantime while this gets done. Uh, they're fine. They're just a little bit less range. They use less... Uh, use a little, little more ammo. But uh, they'll be fine. Uh, let's go ahead and get rail signals just so we're prepared for uh, rails when we need them. And uh, the gate, just so we're prepared with that. Yeah, good to have that. And uh, we can try repair turrets. I think that's going to kill power. Kill my power grid, but uh, we can give that a try. Alright, so this is a good place to end it. Uh, yeah, this took a little while, getting all this up and running. Man, these random recipes really are... ...slowing down my game here. Uh, but that's alright. Uh, we got a wall on the right side. Have we been attacked here yet? No, that, uh, no. Yeah, 
that's good. Okay. I don't think I will anytime soon. But um, we'll have to close this off in a bit. Uh, I kind of want that uranium. That'd be nice to have. And uh, the oil. I need to secure that oil. Right now I don't have access to oil. So we'll get that soon. All right. Well, I think we made good progress today. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon.